is local. She's completely awake for this procedure. We are not doing this on the jaw. Spring and freezing here along my incisions. So the plan for this facelift will be for me to make an incision along the earlobe and then cut out probably this much skin, pull the skin up and then reposition the muscles. Okay, go ahead. I'm just putting some green sterile green towels, wrapping her up. I washed her with uh, chlorhexidine, the antiseptic solution. How are you feeling? Mm. You okay? Mm. Sleepy? Mm. Excellent. Face feels numb? I'm just injecting some fumescent solution. Stop, please. I want you to get a nice nap. Close your eyes and try to relax, okay? We'll do all the work. Just sleep. So we finished all the freezing. She's completely frozen. I'm going to make an incision along the contour of the ear and maybe a little bit behind the ear and I'm going to undermine the skin. section along the jawline here. Are you feeling any pain? No. Nothing? No. Great. Do a little liposuction on the other side. Are you feeling anything? Not yet. Dr. Six, I really like your music. Thank you. <laughs> so do I. <laughs> so now I'm elevating the skin. The skin is above the muscle layer. It's below. See me going underneath the skin with my scissors and creating a space. Doing a facelift, you want to get underneath the skin, and the key here is to making sure that you don't get into the facial nerve. Facial nerve is the minefield you want to avoid. Did you strap down? Yeah. Yeah, we don't want you to move accidentally and touch anything. So I've undermined the skin. And I can, now I can move it easily again. I've undermined the skin, and this allows me to take the skin and pull back that much. Skin, and underneath is the smas layer, the muscle layer. When I pull on it, look what happens over there. I'm lifting her face. Question someone's asking if you're asleep or awake. Are you awake? Yeah. Yeah, you're awake. Perfect. Mind the skin. I'm gonna gauge how much skin I can remove. I can go right about there. Three and a half centimeters of skin pull that I was able to do on her. I made my incision here. I'm gonna take this point, bring it there. It goes pretty easily. And underneath there is the muscle layer which I'm gonna be moving. Can you see it move? is called a SMAS plication. I'm going to plicate the SMAS and put some stitches in here and pull it back to move the jaw and the lower face right. Are you feeling anything? No. No? Good. The beauty of doing a good freezing is that she's fully awake and feels absolutely nothing. Nothing at all. These absorbable stitches, these are deep stitches, they're going to be holding tension. So the skin itself will not be on attention and the scars heal beautifully. I'm so frozen, I can't move my mouth. <laughs> so you sound funny. That's yeah. okay, that's the freezing. I really love doing facelifts. I think it's a very beautiful sort of finesse surgery and I love how it changes one's contour. Like look, she looks like she's 20 years old here.
are you feeling? Excellent. Okay, all done. Yay. You look awesome. So we did this uh, facelift and the local. I made an incision along the ear and then I undermined the skin, the little liposuction there and pulled the skin back and fixed the muscle. So we just finished doing the facelift on a patient that, uh, is, uh, that was awake throughout the procedure and we got a lot of questions. Why was this done on an awake patient? Like so many patients, this lady was really, really not excited about going to sleep and so she opted to be done awake. You could see she was completely comfortable, she had no pain whatsoever. Um, the procedure was done exact same way as if she was asleep, except she was not. Good job. Yeah, but you it. should take some painkillers. You did have surgery, so yeah. I'll, you know, don't try to tough it out. So take something. Yeah. Quarter, that was fun. That was a fun facelift. That was so much fun. I had fun. I really enjoyed it. Are Perfect. Still I'm frozen under I didn't there. Get to it. You know what? It's getting it's like it's probably hot under it's there. It's hot and it's getting like absolutely mushy. Yeah. Tomorrow and we'll change your dressing. Arnica on the bruises. I have arnica. Is that all when, when that I was very educational. <laughs> Sorry? It was educational. Well, you were kind of with your eyes closed. Yeah, but, but it was great. So to go enjoy the video if you want. I will it. enjoy the video. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Awesome. So we'll see you tomorrow morning, okay? Okay. <laughs>